several bond issues worth a total of $236 million appeared on the Omaha City Council agenda for the first time today. If approved, voters would decide on the bonds in November and they could ultimately bring major improvements to the Metro. 6 News' Johan Moran is on your side live in the studio with the details. Jacqueline, John, these bonds would pay for projects listed in the capital improvement plan, supplying money to things like parks, purchases, street pres preservation, and public safety. The largest of the issue is a $146 million bond for public facilities. According to the city, that money would fund planned projects like fixing up the downtown police precinct and fire station, and some of it would also go to the CHI Health Center. The president of the Metropolitan Community Convention Authority says the bond will help cover a major part of their project to add another 40,000 square feet of meeting space on the east side of the building. It's time we do something with the convention center because the business levels have increased in Omaha to the point that, number one, we may start losing the existing clientele we have because we do a lot of repeat business and the primary use factor is meeting rooms. The next largest bond is for transportation, worth more than $80 million. The city says large road projects are paid with federal funds. Those require a local match, which are paid using bonds. Examples of the project to be paid with future bonds include replacing the bridge on Dodge over Saddle Creek. We have full details about the series of bond issues on our website at WOWT.com. And again, no decision is being made today. A vote is not scheduled until the end of the month after a public hearing next Tuesday. If approved, officials are emphasizing the bonds will not raise your property taxes. On your side in the studio, Johan Marin, 6 News.